I am Santosh Gadankar. Today I am teaching you mechanics of material in that one torsion. A solid shaft is subjected to a maximum torque of 25 kilo newton meter. Torque is given here. Data. T is given 25 kilo newton meter. Kilo newton meter. Now it has to be converted in terms of newton mm. 25 into 10 raised to 3. It becomes 25 newton meter. Further, 25 into 10 raised to 3 into 10 raised to 3, it becomes newton mm. It becomes 25 into 10 raised to 6 newton mm. Newton mm. Find the suitable diameter. Find what we have to find out. Diameter we have to find out of a solid shaft. Solid they have given it. If the allowable shear stress and And the twist are limited to the 80 newton per mm square. Tau is given 80 newton per mm square. And one degree theta is given one degree. It has to be converted into pi, radian pi by 180. You have to do it. It get converted in terms of radian for a length of 20 times the diameter. Length is given. L is equal to 20 times the diameter of the shaft. G is given. 80 GPa, which is nothing but 80 into 10 to the power 3 newton per mm square. We have to find out the diameter. Now, this is the formula we have to use is T divided by JP is equal to tau divided by R G theta by L. This is the formula, but it is a diameter. First, I am going to going for these two terms. That is based upon the shear, based upon shear, based on Shear stress based on shear stress that is T divided by J P is equal to tau by R, where J P for solid is nothing but pi by thirty two into d raised to four solid shaft, solid shaft, where R is nothing but d by two. Substitute here in order to get uh, the dimension d. The T value is given. 25 into 10 raised to 6 divided by pi by 32 into d raised to 4. Tau value they have given it is 80. 80 divided by d by 2. 2 and 32 it becomes 16. This day cube cross multiply the d value will be the d value will be d is equal to 116.75 mm. And the length will be L is equal to 20 times d. That means 20 into 116.75. The answer is 2335 mm. 2335 mm. Now based upon the twist. This is based upon the shear. Based upon the twist. Based on twist. In the case of diameter. In case of dimensions, a diameter is con specially diameter is concerned. Every time you have to go with the torque. Don't go with the tau r by theta and g theta by l. Don't go these two combination. In case of d, d is concerned. Every time you have to go compare with that of the torque. Now second is g sorry t divided by j p is equal to g theta by l. G theta by L. Now T is nothing but 25 into 10 raised to 6 pi by 32 into d raised to 4. G value is 80 into 10 raised to 3. Theta is 1 into pi by 180 divided by L. L is nothing but The condition is given L is nothing but 20 by d. In place of L, substitute 20 by d. This this get cancelled. 2020 get cancelled here. Cross multiply. You will get diameter as d is equal to 153.93 mm. And length will be just multiply length here with respect to 20. You will get the length here, based upon the twist, based upon the twist. 
for L will be three zero seven eight point six mm. This has to be substituted here in order to get the length. Now the diameter, the one fifty three point nine three, is larger compared to one one six seven three. Therefore, larger diameter has to be selected. Select larger diameter. Diameter. Larger. Select the larger diameter. That is D is equal to D is equal to one fifty three point nine three mm. In this way, you have to solve the problem. I am Santosh Gaidankar. Thank you very much.